Good evening. So uh, Matt Dykstra, Porch County Emergency Management, EMS. Uh, best way to describe our office is to kind of describe all of our different positions. So how, how we're broken up, again, emergency management and EMS. On the EMS side of the house, we are one of five counties in the, um, in the state that have a county-ran EMS system. Uh, many of you are aware of that. We handle that with a, a total of, of 45 hours to, uh, to administrate um, a three-plus million dollar um, EMS system. With that, we have five hours of my, my time, even though I'm salaried, um, five hours of that goes towards EMS, the administration of that system. We have a 20-hour a week position in our EMS specialist, um, in Joe Brandt. Um, he handles a lot of um, administrative tasks, a lot of the office tasks, as well as um, things with our special event unit, which we cover different special events throughout the county, um, Riverfront Rendezvous, we cover um, over out at the uh, different parks to provide um, our, our medical services out there as well. Other than that, we have a contracted position, our EMS coordinator, um, and again, through that, uh, most of you are pretty aware of um, EMS and how that works, so I'll, I'll go more into the, the emergency management side of the house. So with the emergency management side, it's myself again, and then our, the deputy director, uh, Bert Nitsky. Um, with that, in emergency management, Bert's position handles directly our um, hazardous materials program. We administrate the hazardous materials program under um, the EPA's requirement of Emergency Planning Community Right to Know Act. So um, any of the locations in the county that have hazardous materials, we're required to plan with them to make sure that if anything occurs, that those individuals that are within some different withdrawal zones and everything are aware of what's going on. A lot of people think emergencies, emergency management, you think of the response section of that. Um, we're so much more than that. In the response area, we work directly with the sheriff's office. We work with all the different response agencies to handle a lot of those things, but we also work with um, recovery, we are the liaison to the, the state and federal government for um, different resources that we need when we um, come up short, which is, happens everywhere in every county. Outside of that, we work with mitigation, so we work uh, directly with planning and zoning, um, other, other agencies to find you know, where, can we, where are some of the um, areas where we can beef things up and uh, kind of lessen the impact of future disasters. I could go on forever on this. I'm sure you guys don't want to hear that. Please come by the office um, and I can describe everything in full detail. Thank you.